Welcome back. Neighborville High School athletes never cease to amaze us. It seems whenever our cameras are at the stadium, gym, or field, somebody does something that makes us want to watch again and again. Here now are some examples. The top 10 plays of the year. Hold on to your butts, folks. You're in for a wild ride. We start at Thanksgiving. Hoops for healing tourney. Mike Blazik to Nikki Lopez in overtime. Bang, bang. One of three matchups with Bennett over the course of the season. Lopez owns the first one and the first spot in our countdown. We stick with the winter sport for number nine. Julia Bond, fourth as an individual at the state meet with a 219 and a half average. At Plainfield South, even more impressive. This strike number 11 in a row. Marty Miller trying to keep her calm. Time for the second bonus ball now. Bond, Julia Bond. 300, a perfect game in a 790 series. The junior relieved to have one in her pocket after six years of bowling. She'd get a second perfecto at West Aurora 10 days later. To more recent history for number eight, Zoe Swift and the state champion Huskies all over Mattia in this one. Rope a dope in front of Megan Geldernick, part of a two goal, three assist match for Swift. Here's the real question. Does she get the assist on the ball to herself? We're still researching that one. One thing we do know, the athlete of the spring has a spot at number eight. Things get a bit chilly for number seven. This one, our play of the winter. Nate Schumacher puts a puck on net. Sean McDonald to Taylor Dignan. Well, obviously, you're not a golfer. Golfer or hockey player, either way, number 84 knows the angles. Five-hole goal, this one in the Illini West Division title game. From frozen water to, well, water, Neighborville Quint. Don't know if Simon Shatinsky is a card player, but he certainly has an ace up his sleeve here. 20 seconds left in a tie game with Bonzi. Simon says Taurus Bazellus can only watch the ball go by. This one stands as the game winner for his next move. He'll swim back to his end nonchalantly. Number five brings us a play of the week veteran, Pat Flynn, nominated four times over the course of the soccer season. On this one, he sees Simon Chetensky and says, look what I can do on dry land. Hot sauce, half man, half amazing, the professor, the and one street ball names can all apply here. Yo-yo with a foot, hugs for number five. Teach me how to patty. Song change that means we're in the nitty gritty. Joey Radigan ran for 344 against Bolingbrook and 2200 plus for the season, but he saved his best for the Raiders. Paul Prince, by the way, for you scoring at home, those are broken tackles. The Princeton bound Radigan prefers to have them all on one play. Let's watch. Fifty-three yard run impressive, just as good Bill Ellinghouse sprinting down the sideline. He knows this one has a spot in the top ten. How about a ninth broken tackle? Beast mode for number four. Like this. Football to football now, senior night for Naperville North Soccer. In the 75th minute, Madison Gonzalez has his sights set on the top corner. The guy they call Maddie with sniper-like precision. The Oswego East keeper gives his best effort, but it's no match for number 19. They do call it senior night. Huskies finish 6-1 in the conference and split the DBC with Central. Best celebration? A simple one. Number two took number one last week in our plays of the spring. Just off the top spot here. Tie game, extra innings. Tyler Hasper delivers. Bonus points for the bat toss. In the baseball business, they call this a walk-off dinger, tater, bomb, blast, gonzo, gopher ball. Shout out to Wikipedia for the glossary. Shout out to Hasper for being clutch. Nikwa Sweat, the male and female athlete awards the Wildcats at another title to the NSW trophy case. Like this. We start with a hilltopper though, Glimbard West, Ellen Nybor from the fairway. That's a two on the scorecard, circle it twice. But this foursome not done, Jessica Ewan moments earlier from even farther. Is this shot going to end with anything but a hole out? Yeah, you knew the answer before she swung the club. Ewan would win the sectional in a playoff with a 75. The freshman just as importantly in our eyes takes home play of the year.